how to understand sample rules quickly so you can wrestle and be competitive without getting hurt or hurting your opponents and in this video we'll pay attention to main sample rules let's go in order to understand sample rules you should get few things three things some boys stand up wrestling it's down position wrestling and prohibited actions which you're not supposed to do of course first stand up wrestling today my helper Alexei Lukasov, Samba coach in Germany, City Targau. So, standing up. First of all, you can win by collecting technical actions. So there is a clean victory for clean throw. It's when I throw somebody with any throw and he falls flat on his back. And I remain standing. If I go with him and my knee is on him or my hand is on him, it's already parter. Standing is only when two feet on the floor. So that was a clean throw. I'm done. I won. Or you can win by points you can win with a total superiority which means eight point differential eight to sixteen that's a technical superiority how do you score four two and one points let's go with four points four points when somebody falls flat on their back but I go down with him. So anytime he is flat and I'm down, it's four points. Two points is when my opponent falls on his side. And I'm down as well. You see, he's on his side. Two points. And one point. When somebody falls on their butt. Or on his stomach. Also one point. Also one point when opponent falls on his shoulder. Also one point. Also one point when I do some technical action and he falls on his waist. But shoulder blades are not on the floor, so only the waist, but shoulder blades are up. One point. And one person falls on his chest, not stomach, but chest. And I fall down with him. Also one point. One more time. Fallen. On belly, chest, shoulder, buttocks and waist. All of that is one point. If I remain standing, all of that multiplied by two. If you fall on his butt and I remain standing, Two points if I remain standing. Fell on his back, clean throw. Oh. 
So it's like eight points, kind of, sort of. So we're done with the standing up. Let's go parter, mat work. You can win before time expires by submission. What are the submissions? On an arm, knee submission, ankle submission. Knee could be hyperextended only in a straight fashion. Only straight like this. Not sideways, it's illegal. Achilles lock only normal straight squeeze. You cannot twist the foot. It's prohibited. Arms. More subs. No wrist locks. Elbow either straight or twisting. Same thing with the shoulder. You can twist. And I forgot about the legs. You can twist hips. Like a hip knot. Another submission type is squeezing, compressing or slicing. Like a bicep slicer. We squeeze it, right? Bicep slicer. So let's summarize. You can win by submission, arm lock or leg lock. Sometimes submission is hard to do, but you can still score with a mat work. So four points for pinning, for holding somebody down. When we hold him on his back. But there is a little know-how. You should be either chest to chest, side to chest, or back to chest. So body contact. If I'm on his belly, it's got to be on the chest. So side, chest, and my back on his chest. If I'm holding for 20 seconds, I get four points. If I hold between 10 and 19 seconds and he escaped by pressing away, that's two points. Eight, nine seconds, no counting. So you can only do one pin for four points. Or two 10 second ones. Total amount of points is four. So either four right right away or two and two. And last thing you should know. Prohibited actions for which you can be disqualified or be warned. DQ, there are two types of DQ. Prohibited actions and prohibited moves. I have something on my channel that I show what's illegal so let's talk about prohibited actions like dropping somebody on their head or against the joint and he gets traumatized so that's illegal prohibited action if i do it and he gets hurt i get disqualified on a spot then there's also prohibited actions such as disrespecting your opponent if I hit him, if I uh, call the name, either spectators, coaches, or judges, any kind of unsportsmanlike conduct, I'll get disqualified immediately. And one more type is when I'm being passive. I try to escape from being active or run away from the mat or 
because I am afraid to fall, I drop to my knees and avoid live wrestling. At, f at first, you get the warning, doesn't mean anything. Then a second warning, he gets a point. Another warning, second point. And a fourth DQ. Prohibited actions. There are bad ones and not so bad ones. For example, cannot grab fingers, nose, ears, hair. If I grab once, first warning, second time, some other prohibited action, DQ immediately. No fingers and eyes, or up nose, mouth, you, you get it, right? All the gentlemen rules, all normal people do not do. If you decide to wrestle, understand three judges in the center, in the corner, and table judge. And two of them have to agree on a score. Samba is a great and merited sport. Do Samba, train in it. Let's make it popular all over the world and in every town. Samba without limits. See you soon. Dubai. Это бросок на бок. Когда я его бросаю, опа, и он падает на бочок. Можно вы, выиграть болевым приемом на руку, на колено, на сил, на ущемление мышцы и на скручивание локтя, плеча, тазобедренного сустава.